welcome back welcome back i am making god these things suck ender like crazy <laughs> i'm trying to make more suck tests ender that sounds like they some kind of move <laughs> uh, suck my, it's like a rim job ender. right <laughs> <laughs> It's it's one of one of those things. Um, come on, give, give me enough. Give me enough. Give me enough. There we go. Um, I I don't know if you noticed today or not. Probably good. if you guys are watching this, it's been like a, a week or two weeks. Or something <laughs> like that, but a while back. I, I I restarted. I'm gonna try to get more content for it. I can't call it a series per se because I just do it when I find like really funny things. But I had some more best of Craigslist. And those video, man, and some of the Craigslist ads, they are so goddamn funny. It, it's its ridiculous. A lot of them are fake, I'm sure. But yeah, I think still. a lot of that stuff. I've actually been looking for a skee ball table for years. And I always go to Craigslist to look like, you know, just to see, is there anyone, anyone out there selling a skee ball table these, these days? Like the, the thing is, too, they make new skee ball tables. But they're like not the same as like the ones like when we were kids, and like I don't want one of the new shitty ski ball tables. I want one of the like where it's got the little the wooden guess... brown balls. Uh, but okay, you, so you're. I was about to clarify what you mean by a ski ball table because I guess it's not really a table, but it's I guess it's called well, a ski ball table, isn't it? I I've never called it a table before, but yeah, I guess it's really not a table. I a ski called, ball. I, I was just I well, just what is it? Ski ball, but yeah, it's just ski ball. Like. You, you made me kind of wonder. Yeah, yeah, because it's not definitely not a table. Mean? A ski ball slope, mm. ski ball ring. Mm. Yeah, the ski ball. So yeah, Craigslist. Um, uh, it's, uh, so who the hell? Who find? You know how they have personals on there. Do you do you think that anyone actually goes to Craigslist looking for like the love of their life? I I, do, I would think that yes, people probably do, and I bet they're sorely disappointed when when they do such things. Um, but I'm trying to think if I've ever heard of somebody who actually had a, like a successful right like, meetup actually, on Craigslist, and I don't think I I don't think I've ever known anybody who had a successful Craigslist meetup. I would be life. scared. Like I actually, <clears throat> um, I. A friend of a friend, basically, um, was friends with someone. Like a friend of mine was friends with someone. Friend of a friend was friends with. Someone. No, yeah, yeah. Let me, let me back. Let me back it up a little bit. A friend of a friend was a Craigslist murderer, basically. Like a friend of mine. Oh. Had a friend oh. <laughs> that her and her boyfriend <laughs> met multiple people and killed them from Craigslist. Wait. For for what reasons? Just no reason. They, they just like, wanted to, to kill, kill people, people, and they just decided that they would post like on the personal section of Craigslist. Um, uh, this was in South Carolina, and uh, they just stabbed them, stabbed them up. So, I, I guess, however, that answers a question that you had. Yes, <laughs> yeah, people, people do meet and they kill them. <laughs> <laughs> well, the, but they they use Craigslist for the exact thing that you were curious about because obviously they found people to kill right right how they find people to kill it's because it was people who or not, you're they, right they murdered um yes yeah, so, so pe people people used it apparently i think that's weird and they died. um but so I, w I will tell you when i had this series running before serious like it was a handful of videos but i started trying to find instead of finding the ones that are known as like the best of craigslist i would go try to find my own and i figured what better place to do that than from the craigslist souls and the what do they call it uh miscellaneous encounters random encounters whatever they're like basically like yeah hookup section is the not, not even the dating it's just the like the Ashley Madison of Craigslist type right. of deal. Like, I've looked at there and before, and it's it, it all seems either, like, f half of it seems fake, like bots or something, and the other half is, like, prostitutes, I feel. I would agree with the exact same sentiment. The funny thing is, I got my IP address blocked multiple times in, like, a month span, and I finally pinpointed it down... That it was every time, like the day after, I would go researching for better articles or better p posts to see if I could find something that was funny. It was when my IP address would get blocked by Craigslist. So, Why? 
I, so that's the thing. I started looking into it because I was really curious. And it turns out, for whatever reason, people basically, if you cruise the Craigslist uh, miscellaneous room, I don't remember what the, what the hell is it called. Now it's going to drive me insane. Craigslist. Uh, it's God, it's in the personals, but what the hell do they call it? I don't know. The... The... Can't even see a personal section on the Craigslist I'm looking at right now. Don't they all? The hell? I thought so. Oh, did they do away with it? <laughs> oh no, no, there it is. It's right, it's right above my face. I just missed it. Oh, casual encounters. That's what they call it. Casual oh, encounters. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, um, apparently, when you peruse, because I I started looking up like why is my IP address blocked on Craigslist, and a lot multiple all the comments were like. Um, you know, people in forums were asking the same questions. People would be like, well, stop perusing, uh, perusing the casual encounters. And I'm like, but that doesn't make any sense. But it seems that Craigslist themselves has something built into their system where it, for some reason, blocks, they block your IP when you look at their casual encounter section. Why? I don't know. It doesn't make any sense to me. On why you would have a section that you're just gonna block people if they use it. So then, so but you would the, the whole site would be like to. you couldn't go to anywhere on the whole site. Correct. We used to, we would have problems. Like my old roommate would be like, "Hey Jeff, the Craigslist is doing that weird thing again where it's saying we're blocked." And at first, I couldn't understand why, because for one, I wasn't. I was doing it to look for stuff, so it wasn't on the front of my mind because I was just looking for random funny stories, and it would work for, like, that day, and it was always the next day. It took a couple times of it happening for me to go, you know, last night I was on Craigslist, and it worked just fine. Again, and every time it was like, but every time I was perusing that, looking for funny ads and ridiculous people that were on there. Um And so that's hmm. the only thing I can really bring it down to, and it doesn't make any sense to me. I can't fathom... Because I never would email these people. Right. So if I'm not emailing them or clicking anything on, on them, why uh, otherwise there's absolutely That's no so weird. Why do they even have that section then? Anything. It's like a there's like I a troll. Know. I I, I I don't know. I don't know. Maybe somebody out there who, who will admit that they've used it for like other purposes can you know, admit or refute like what I'm saying about it that's true or not, because that's just my speculation based on reading the forums trying to find out why I'd be uh, blocked from Craigslist. So I had to like reset my, on my, my IP address at my, on the, on the, on the router uh, or whatever, modem, the, the router side. Yeah. You had to find out how to set the IP address from your cable company every time, which caused huge problems. Cause I utilize like, um, as static as I can, it's not a static IP, but I do remote desktop all the time to my computer, which if you, right. if you keep getting your IP address change, it makes it a pain in the ass to like deal with that stuff. You can get but like that whole concept. Dying DNS never, it doesn't make thing. any sense to me. Yeah, that's really weird. I didn't. I've never heard of that. I didn't know they did that. That's. Uh, <laughs> uh, what's? Why would you have something like that? To, I like it. Just, it just, I just don't get it. I yeah. Don't, I, I don't know. Why would you ever block people at the IP level anyway? That, yeah, that that, that is always a weird thing. Like, like yeah. Because you can always change your IP. I can't say you can't always change your IP, I guess. But as yeah. a home user, a st an average home user can change their IP address. Right. I actually have a static IP problem. myself. So that would be – so don't peruse those looking for funny stories, dude. Because yeah. you'll never be able to get on Craigslist again. That's, so let's see. Tier hmm. But I, I have looked around in there, like, again, for – I mean, not, not, not that I was going to do a video on it like you were, but uh, just because it's like – what is actually in here? Like, and uh, I didn't, I didn't get blocked. So I guess, I guess I, I don't know. Maybe I didn't do it enough. I don't know. Maybe, maybe I just did something wrong and they determined that I, I don't, I don't have any idea because like, I, I wish I could say that, you know, oh, this is when I was, you know, younger and I actually did try to contact people and I kept getting blocked. Like, cause that would make more sense to me, but I didn't ever contact these people. Yeah. I didn't click on any of the links. I didn't do anything. I didn't post anything. I was reading other people's postings, but you know, so at the same time, it's funny. Cause even though the forums would like guide me to say that it was always my roommate who pointed out the fact that it was blocked. Oh, maybe he was. Maybe so, maybe we could get all our questions answered right now. Your roommate, if you, if you, yeah, just like call I, him up, be like, so, so are they all prostitutes? <laughs> <laughs> just just say that and see what he says. Just, just let me 
know. Are they really all prostitutes? <laughs> it's like no me. context or anything. Just say those words and see what happens. Yeah. So, so I guess it, it truly could have just been him actually doing like shady things yeah. on there, and it was just coincidentally the, the days after I would be researching stuff like that. That would be really funny. God, we still need we need two, four, six, eight tier nine. So don't kill all the tier nines. Okay. Oh. Uh... I hope it did not automatically kill the tier nines. Hold on, we might have some over. No, we don't. Looking. Okay, we got, yeah, we got 14. I got 41 is. tier tens and 14 tier nines. Okay. Those. I don't know where this rocket takes us, though. I swear online it says there's the Kepler B whatever, but I don't know where that's at. <laughs> well, we can try to find out. Here, pass me off those, uh, those tiered thingies you've got. Because there's the yellow diamond, too, that's on somewhere. Yeah, it's tier 10, <laughs> yellow diamond. That's from Kepler 22B, yellow diamond ore. Where the fuck is Kepler 22B at? I don't know. But I have the nose cone, the four fins. I think to make oh, wait, that's boost. Cooper belt. <laughs> Cooper. Cooper. The Kuiper belt? Kuiper. Oh, yeah. Well, right. Hey. Kuiper. So, where is Kepler 22B? Uh, I keep saying that. You, you keep saying you don't know. But I'm going to say it again, Jeff. <laughs> where the fuck's it at? Oh, why didn't you just ask, dude? Why yeah. Is... Let's see. Make my button. Make, make, make. My... Make, <laughs> make. Make. Let's see. Oh, stupid tin can. I grabbed one and I was like, I don't need it for this part. And I put it back. I wonder what and I these moons are going to be like. It. I can't believe we didn't know about know. these moons. But once we get, uh, yeah, I was going to say it's, so if, if you're watching people, we found out that there's moons and I mean, we thought it was with this new update, but apparently they've probably been there the whole time and we just didn't zoom into the planets to see them. Uh, so, that's us for you. So these guys need... Oh, I need four compressed dark irons as well. Four uh, eight compressed dark irons. There might still be... I was reading about this planet. Kepler-22b. Kepler-22b. Comfortably circling within the habitable zone. This diagram... Kepler twenty to be a star system containing the first habitable zone plant discovered by Naplo's Kepler mission. Oh, it's it's in a different solar system. Well, how the hell did we get over there? I don't know. The tier eleven rocket. Oh, oh! Scroll to the left. Wait, what? You gotta be shitting me. Hold on. Let me yeah. Get things filled up. Kepler twenty two system. Scroll to the left. Scroll. Or not scroll, like click scroll. your mouse and drag to the left in the map. Oh, what? Yeah. You can zoom out with the mouse wheel and there's multiple systems. Oh, two, three, there is. Four other systems. What the fuck? Are those, are those, are those? Oh, this is, oh, the Kep, Kep, Kepler 2260. Oh, these are all the other ones that we could see on their site, but. Uh, uh, that said they're coming soon. Yeah. So this one's going to revolve around a whole different sun? Yeah, that's kind of cool. Kepler right. 22 star. Whoa, 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 whoa. Kepler 22b is... Good lord. I'm, uh, I am I kind of want to go to that one first. Well, that's where we... Uh, I mean, yeah. Yeah, fuck the other moons. I mean, they're just moons. Yeah, fuck... Moons will be in existence forever. That thing will go away soon. <laughs> it's got yellow diamond. I don't know what yellow. that means. Oh, didn't we? Didn't we see the yellow diamond somewhere? Yeah, we saw it in the eye. There's, there's yellow. Di oh, there is a use for it now. There's yellow diamond uh, helmets and armor. I wonder. And a pickaxe. And do we have shark iron? Oh, right. I was going to give you that. I think it's. Yeah. I think we still think we still got some in this. Yeah, we here we go. This compressor. I, I, I took it out there. 
<laughs> okay. So, so this should be the last pieces of this. There we go. Uh, and you. There we go. I, I feel got like all um, the pieces. I feel like McDougal should just hook up with this guy. <laughs> not not like and, not like a Craigslist teams. personal. But <laughs> <laughs> are, are you sure? Um, Maybe and, they already have. <laughs> right. <laughs> right. <laughs> Uh, but yeah, and then, and then instead of him like working on, like instead of recreating the stuff this guy has done, they should, it should just become to come together, come together. <laughs> I'm really surprised Craigslist has not changed much in the past. I, I read an years. article about Craigslist at some point about the guy that made it like, <sighs> he's like really rich and like won't sell it and it'll never have ads and all this stuff um yeah i don't how is he is he he's not rich from craigslist no huh he was rich for something else and i think his name's craig <laughs> the last name of the list <laughs> right it was craig like seth bling <laughs> we got new rockets upstairs you going uh, I need to get some supplies if I am. I need a tesseract. I need uh, a landing pad. Let me see. So I got some extra tesseracts now. I got some extra landing pads now. And I set up some things down here so that they're basically ready to get yeah, done. Yeah, I saw that. I added a, a this thing is a full for Aries. tesseract, right? Yes. Okay. And I'm in. Blast off! Now I wait. This thing is so big now you can't like even see it in the window. <laughs> Dude, the the amount of exhaust coming down in here. They should make it so like the bigger the rocket, like the more shit around it, it burns. Yeah. You do have four yeah, boosters on that one. I guess you are leaving the went. entire solar system there. I only made two. I'm surprised it didn't make me make four boosters because I really did only have to make two. Yeah. This rocket's not very fast for being leaving the solar system. It's gonna be a long journey. I'm kind of intrigued at what a different solar system is gonna be like. I am too. Like, is it gonna be a? Because it's. Oh, what I read this planet is it's supposed to be an, an Earth-like planet. So are we, is it going to be just like regular Minecraft? <laughs> that, that would be kind of hilarious. It's just another... Just another world. Okay, there are let's other see. worlds than these. So it's, sorry, this is the Kuiper Belt, right? No. That no, is... No, it's not the Kuiper Belt. Yeah. Yeah, the Kep oh, that's Kepler okay. or whatever. What the fuck is it? How's it, how's it say? Kepler twenty two B. We can create a space station, but we need holy shit twenty four blue diamonds, twenty four red diamonds, twenty four purple diamonds, twenty four yellow diamonds, and twenty four green diamonds. Oh, cool! To create a space station. I think those other diamonds come from different uh, things. So I'm Kepler going, is the name Whoa. of um is a, is a real thing. You just that downloaded the terrain. It's. Uh, I'm excited for this. Um, it's named after it, uh, a, it's a trees. space probe. There's trees. Are they like normal trees? Uh, I mean, not, yes and no. So kind of no. It's uh, they like red trees. They're Kepler maple leaves. There's it's definitely an Earth-like biome planet. Like this is actually different though. This is kind of exciting. Um, All right, set me up. I'm ready. Beat me up, let Scotty. Me put this. Tesseract, you're excited. Hold on, uh, boom, and this thing we will call it Kepler 22B base enabled. So you should be able to come to it, and now it's going to go to the Earth Hub as well. I just need to give it some power to. Tesseract needs to come from. Where are we getting this power from? Space power? Yeah. I wonder what the power of that star is. What the power of the star? Yeah. Like, what star? 
the 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 sun here. Oh oh oh! I got gotcha. you. Um, if it gives like an environmental boost. Yeah, look at the stars. They're so the different. Sun. Well, I just went back to Earth real quick to. Uh, oh, this is so cool, drop man. Off the rocket. Yeah, yeah. This is definitely. There's a sheep. Cool. What the hell? The sheep live here too. I'm getting. I'm dying. You're dying. What the fuck? Why you die? I I don't know. I'm getting beat up by something. I'm in our house. Do you die? No. But I, fucking audio. Why fuck? why it do this? I was literally just getting hit by something in our house that was invisible. That's crazy. Were you did it maybe think you were in the wall or something? And, uh, I, I, I mean, I guess it's possible because we traveled such a long distance. They're trying to add reality to these teleports and say they're not perfect. Maybe our bot, my body hadn't fused yet with. Uh... <laughs> I don't think that's the thing. Oh man, I, I did not I know, set a waypoint before I went flying off like a fucking idiot here. Yeah, I'll be there momentarily because I'm going to. Uh, I just dropped off the rocket. I didn't want to lose it somewhere. And. Yoink. I can tell you where it's at. It should be at like zero one seventy five or whatever. If there's anything like yeah, it's, uh, ne oh, yeah, yeah it. negative nine one eighty. See it here we go. It'll be Kepler base. Oh, well, there you are. So the gravity seems normal. Whoa. Is it? Should... It seems to be. Oh, these. Enemies hit freaking hard. Oh, there's like is there cave, oxygen like, right here? Do you have a torch? Know. Let's. Uh, I do have a torch. Let me find. Oh that. yeah, yeah. There's oxygen because we don't have any tanks up. Oh yeah. So this is just like a normal planet. I found a cave. I found a cave. There's a cave right under where we spawned. It looks just like a Got normal Kepler iron ore. It's like red tinted. Yeah. I guess I don't need to put down those stupid torches because I got goggles. Oh, yeah. That's a good point. Was it G? Oh, but what's it, weird is mm, it still has space mobs. It does have space mobs. That is interesting to to notice. Oh, this cave But it's nowhere. got passive animals. That's weird. Are they space passive animals? No, they just have... They're just regular pigs and whatever. I wonder if, like, it's so, but space chickens could probably breed here, right? Oh, yeah. Yeah, we could. We could bring, we could bring the, the, the chocobos. Hey, that's, that, that makes things a lot simpler, really. You could, you don't have to worry about a stupid oxygen setup that you don't always have to worry breaks. about oxygen, right. I oh, this... I looked at our little pen outside that had all, all the mini-me's in it, and the only thing left is a mini-dock. <laughs> what what happened to I them? don't know where all the other guys went to. It's just left. But they I want the sun pen. to rise. They were caged, caged yeah. animals. Oh, there's like a so I wonder biome. if it's gonna be like difficult to find a uh, dungeon. I don't think there is one because oh, because there's not another yeah, tier there's another tier eleven. Oh, dude, I found this really lime green biome that doesn't have a bunch of trees. It's really cool. What kind of trees are these? Green this is maple. just a, an extremely tree-y place. Yeah, I thought the whole planet was like that, but then I found this this plains-looking biome that doesn't have a bunch of trees on it. Oh, yeah, I have not found anything. Oh, I'm generating too much terrain. The server's getting upset. I want the sun to rise. I really want to see what the sun looks like. Yeah, the stars do look really cool. Oh, it's raining. So it rains on this planet. There's pigs, there's sheep. Maybe really... there's a village. I haven't found one yet, but maybe. <laughs> you think they they could trade? <laughs> it's a, oh, I found the plains biome that you're talking about, or a plains biome. It's like lime green. Yeah, it's very green and with like brown trees. Oh uh, yeah, brown maple leaves. Um, the Whoa. sun is rising. I'm excited for this. These enemies are fast as hell, though. What is this? A Kepler maple log. 
You think they have their own tree saplings? Oh yeah. Kill this tree. Probably, and find right? Out. Oh no, I just killed the whole tree. Oh yeah, I did get some uh, purple. I got purple maple saplings out of a yellow tree. <laughs> that was interesting. I want to find like a really good cave. And I was like going off and oh god, the sun is big. Yeah, that's what I wanted to see. I'm cruising. So I wonder where these purple, red, blue... I don't, that's what I'm wondering. Do we have to go, like, legit caving for them? Or is there... Oh, yeah. Kepler B-22 red diamond ore. Kepler B purple diamond ore. So all of those diamonds come from here. Blue diamond ore. Cause I, oh, I found a village. Found a village. Takes a village. It's what? I said it takes a village. You know that takes it, a village a, to raise a, a child? It's... <laughs> It's definitely a space village with space guys in it. Oh. I have, do they trade? I no. Yeah, no. They didn't. They're from Galacticraft Core. Uh, they haven't upgraded. They haven't upgraded. They haven't assimilated to uh, the next level yet. I'm just going to dig straight down and see if I can uh, find uh, some, some of this diamond. I would love to build a space station and see if it's any different. Yeah, we haven't done that on any of them, have we? No, uh, we built one space. I built one space station, and it was basically, you know, the exact same space station. Instead of Earth that was outside of it, it was like a moon looking thing. I found dense coal ore. Uh, we probably. Oh, know. hey, that's pretty cool. If you smelt the dense coal ore, it becomes a block of coal. Oh, so it's worth a lot of coal. Yeah. I guess we can just bring the um, Ender Quarry up here. Oh, yeah, that's that's definitely the way to do it. I found some green diamonds. Uh, so they're not super low, or did you actually get all Oh, the yeah, they were on too? bedrock, literally. Oh. So, yeah, we'll need the uh, Ender Quarry for sure. I was hoping if I... I haven't seen any water up here. I did see some. Oh, here we go. So was it an ocean or was it a... No, it was just like little little pools of water. Um, the the thing I was on broke into a cave and there is, uh, there's all the diamonds here. There's copper, there's some red diamonds. All the diamonds. Where it is... They break really fast. Like, there's just like their durability, these diamond durability is really low. So I got six green diamonds... I hope there's like real dungeons up here. Oh, that'd be cool. I bet there's nothing up here. I bet this has just been made and like not nothing's really been done with it. Yellow diamond. There's a lot of diamonds here. Oh, I found a swamp. Swamp looking area. So there is big chunks of water around as well. Okay. Yeah, if you can get 24 of each diamond, I don't know if you can do that that quick, but I'd love to build the space station and see what it looks like. I bet it's going to be the same old shit, sadly. It just needs such a ridiculous amount of a different type of material. Right. That I hope that it's somewhat different. I'm up to nine of each diamond. Going the wrong way. There's... I head back toward Kepler base. They they spawn in really big chunks though. Like I just found ten blue diamond altogether. I'm gonna go right below our base and then just dig straight down. Yeah, that's what I did. Was just dug straight down. Hopefully this will break out into something by the base here. Yeah, something I'm digging through has like zero durability because randomly I hit this pocket where I drop like four. <laughs> yeah, it's it's any of these diamonds, the copper ore, basically any of the ores That's on this right. planet are just like made out of damn paper. The tin, iron, dirt, blue diamond ore. 
Yeah, you're right. They are like made out of paper, and they do spawn in these weird chunks. That did not hit a cave for sure, but. I got, I got cave everywhere here. I'm try to dig my way to cave at bedrock. Where did that thing just go? There's some weird purple stuff around, but it doesn't want to jump in my inventory. Oh, per the purple diamond ore does not look like a diamond in your inventory. What's the oh, yeah, all of them just look, they look like the ore once you get them, right? Uh, well, no, they look like an ore. The purple diamond ore literally looks like, unless it's the tint on my screen, it just looks like a dirt block, kind of. God, yeah, you're right. There is diamond everywhere down here. Oh, yeah, the purple. Yeah, I got 15 of the purple, 12 of the red, uh, 18 of the blue, 18 of the green. I have 13 purple, 3 green, 6 blue. The yellow is what I'm having trouble finding so far. I got two of that I don't one. Think I don't think I have any yellow. Uh, yellow must be rare. Or Do you have any of it yet? I have two. Uh. Yeah, I'm just digging a straight line, and I just came across four ores. Did you say whore ores? Yeah, whore ores. They're <laughs> from Craigslist. <laughs> so to say, I think casual. Do you have a casual encounter with them? <laughs> yep, yep. And misconnection, hmm. and they. Uh... You know, that's a that's a that's a good one. The misconnections. That is the, the most the strangest really thing. Funny. If you read those, it's like who. Who the fuck? Who? Who? Like, some of this is just so crazy. It's like, I saw you today at the gas station. You were wearing a blue shirt. Contact me. <laughs> Please. Like, yeah. I, I, would I would love to know statistics on anybody who actually was, like, found somebody on misconnections. That was not, like, a long term. That was literally, like, the I was driving by a store and saw you through the window type of misconnection. Right, right. That shit just I would blows love my mind. To see the stats on that, dude. I just got a pocket with eight yellows in it. Oh, good. Okay, so maybe they're not rare. Maybe just been unlucky. I just want us to get up to twenty-four of each, so that somebody can make a space station that we can go. Oh visit. man, we're at thirty-two minutes. We gotta. We we'll have to do that in another episode, I guess. Okay. Oh, I found the dense coal too. See you guys next time. Bye.